In this tutorial, I will show you how to create a barcode using the ID Automation PHP Generator script. The tutorial also assumes that the WAMP server is installed and properly configured, and that the licensed version of the ID Automation PHP Generator script is downloaded. The demo version that produces a static barcode can be downloaded from idautomation.com, search PHP Generator. Extract the file. To make the product easy to find, let's place it on our desktop. Navigate through the first ID Automation PHP folder to find PHP files for several barcode types including Code 39 and Code 128. I am going to create a Code 128 barcode using the ID Automation Code 128 PHP file. To the left of the ID Automation zip file, you will see WAMP Server, stands for Windows, Apache, MySQL, and in this case PHP. It is the web server that I will use to run my project. You can download the WAMP Server from WAMPServer.com. Open the PHP Generator script that contains PHP files for different barcode types. Let's copy out the ID Automation Code128 PHP file. Let's go to our web root directory and create a project. Let's create a project folder named Barcode. Go into the barcode folder and place the copied ID Automation PHP file there. Let's start the WAMP server. To view all server options, Left click the WAMP icon, select localhost. Here you'll have access to your project directory. Now let's begin our project. We are going to create an HTML form and a PHP file that the form will access. Open up a text editor. For this tutorial I am using Ultra Edit. We are going to create and save a file named barcode.html to our barcode directory. Let's start with our HTML tags. Place a header and call it create a barcode. In the next line, add a form action so that we can send the data from this form to a PHP file that we will create. We are going to go ahead and create a name for that file and let's go ahead and call it create.php. Method post is going to send the information that we enter into our form to the create.php file. Place a break. Now, let's create a text box that will receive the data input. I will name it data to encode as this is the data that we will turn into the barcode. For input type, we will create a submit button that will send the data.
Let's complete our tags and save the file. Create another file named create.php and save it to your barcode directory. This file is going to receive information entered into the barcode.html file. Use the PHP opening tag. Create a PHP variable. We will name it data to encode and we will set that variable to the data entered into the form. To see how the data is actually passed, let's look at the barcode and create files. Close the PHP tag. Now let's reference the barcode from the ID Automation Code 128 PHP file. Type in the file name of the ID Automation Code 128 file. The ID Automation script products properties can be modified using several parameters. Our example focuses on the data that will be used to create the barcode use d equal. To pass our variable into the d parameter we must once again use PHP tags. Use echo to output the value stored in the data to encode variable. Close all tags and save the file. Go to your site and open barcode.html. The HTML barcode form allows you to enter data and submit that information to the create.php file which uses the ID Automation Code 128 PHP file to generate a barcode. A barcode is generated using PHP.